All right, so Iraqi troops launching an offensive late last night to take back the ISIS stronghold of Mosul. We've known that this offensive would be coming, and now it is underway. The city's been under ISIS control for more than two years. Connor Powell joins us live now from Jerusalem with this report. Good morning, Connor. Good morning, Martha. That operation began about 4 a.m. local time with Iraqi Prime Minister Abadi announcing that that operation had started. Now, Iraqi security forces moving up from the south. Uh, it Mosul's about 250 miles or so northwest uh, of Baghdad. It sits along the Turkish Syrian border. Uh, Kurdish forces are moving in from uh, the northern part, but right now the operation seems to be focused on the territory and towns outside of Mosul. We're getting reports that Peshmerga forces and Iraqi security forces have seized several of the towns out there. Uh, the U.S.-led coalition has begun its air bombing campaign and also heavy artillery uh, pounding ISIS in, in that area. It seems that the strategy is to try to, one, offer ISIS a way out of Mosul. The western part of the city is very much open right now. Those fighters can be uh, sort of open to leaving and going into Syria while Iraqi and Peshmerga forces push up from the south and the north and from the east. Uh, this, this operation will take some time. There's a couple thousand ISIS fighters in that city, and there are more than uh, a million refugees, so there's a large concern about civilian de uh, casualties and deaths. So this coalition will take its time, Martha. All right. Connor, thank you very okay. much.